Hey everybody, I'm Matt Finish and welcome back to the randomizer. I uh, kind of moved ahead a little bit, not too much. We're going to be uh, entering Lower Norfair today. And dodging the lava hands by running into them face first because I can't do a smart thing and say a smart thing at the same time. Go me. Oh. I'm just beating myself up today, aren't I? All right, there's a wave gate that way, but I don't need to go to it. And that guy needed to get blown up. So here's the trick with this room. You would think, okay, I just gotta jump over here. Okay, I need to be my morph ball. I'm gonna come up here, da 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 da, -da. and then you get stuck. And you realize that you overshot the door or undershot the door. Again, gravity suit, wave suit, and you need the space jump. Unless you are one of the magical uh, speedrunners. And you can get yourself up here. Or, you know, be just a normal uh, Let's Player on YouTube and suck. Okay. And go into the Ridley mouth and come inside. This room. The elevator. Takes you into Lower Norfair. This is where Ridley hangs out. If you couldn't tell. Ridley's a pain in the butt. And normally you don't have you don't have to go this way. I'm gonna go this way. Oh, we're totally making a side trip. Just had a, an epiphany moment. Anyways, ah, don't wanna go in this lava. Hot lava. If you power bomb here, there's this dude. Morph again. Like you did with the guy who walked you. And he summons the lava. Or D summons the lava? Unsummons the lava? He makes you go bye bye. And then he drops you like you're discarded garbage and just makes you like plummet. And then I can use my bombs because, you know, I totally have those. Oh, I can shoot the lava balls? Cool, I didn't know that. I always thought I was just gonna die to those guys because they were invincible. Okay. Do not let the floor deceive you. You will fall, and then you will get stuck. Grab the heart piece. Grab your best weapon. And fall down. And this guy's going to fall down, and he's a butt. However, if you can force him to jump back in the corner, duck, hold L and R, and just unload, you normally can uh, get him pinned and uh, win. But I don't have enough super missiles for that. Come on. Or does he just dodge? He just dodges regular missiles. Like there ain't no thing. Oh, boy. Man, I'm looking so terrible right now. I cannot afford to lose this fight. There we go. Shoot the puke ball so I can get stronger stuffs. Thank you. More puke balls, please. More, more. Nope. I need more, please. More puke balls. Ah! This guy's gonna kill me before I can kill him, and that's a problem. Oh my gosh. Are you serious? This is bad. I'm gonna be able to be really mad. Uh. Oh my goodness. I've never had a bad run before with this guy. Of course, I never ran out of super missiles either, so... 
Literally, his most powerful attack is to just run into me at mock speed. And there's something up there too, but I can't deal with it right now. Mm. Yep. Okay. If 50 super missiles isn't enough this time, I'll quit YouTube for 15 minutes. Come on, you piece of garbage. Back up. Back up. Why are you not... I'm like in the magic spot and it's not doing it. Oh my gosh. Why am I having problems? There we go. Worst runs ever. Worst. This is like. Forget that guy. Worst boss. And I had one super missile left. Oh. Okay. So the screw attack, I get a bug net. I can live with that. Because the bug net's still fairly useful. So we are going to take a detour. We're going in here because th we need the screw attack. I feel we need screw attack. We need screw attack. This is the Misery Mire. And I need the Quake Spell to get into the dungeon. Good thing I got it. But I'm more interested in over here. Okay. Charge beam? Good. And an energy tank. All right, all right. I'm glad I came here. And I don't think... Should I... I mean, mm. you seriously are paying the butt. I'm trying to remember everything. You can tell me something because you fill up my hearts. Okay, guys, I'll give you credit on that one. That was a good joke. I know I kind of went through it fast, so you're going to have to go back to the video and kind of pause it. But basically, the bee, or the guy in the bee suit, made a blind melon reference. That was very classic. Good job. All right. Up here is another light world swap to loot. That's such a terrible indicator. Okay. What do I get? 
The single arrow. Forget you. The worst loot. That's fine. I'm gonna do something here. It's a little drastic. Because until I get the flute, I won't be able to come back here. Without having to run through Lord of Norfair. But we're gonna activate the Quake spell. Stop the rain. So I can't go through this dungeon because I don't have the hook shot. But if done right, I can bypass the book necessary to get into the desert palace. Which is what we're going to do. Obviously since I already went in. Good job talking, man. You get a cookie. All right, let's get some loot here. Awesome. Love seeing the big key. Need some little keys though too. There we go. Thank you. And run, 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 run. I hate trying to run around those guys because you always hit them. Okay, that's what we got here. Oh, map. A lot of these rooms are kind of pointless for me, except this one. The x-ray scope. Kind of not needed, but definitely appreciate it. What would normally be the big key is, uh... The compass. No, the extra scope is very useful in Super Metroid if you've never played before. And you haven't had to memorize where every single spot is. Because it helps you look through walls. That's actually very, you know, very neat. Leave me alone. Oh, which one of you is it? Is it this one? That one. Oh, yeah. So with the bug net, I can catch the fairies, keep one in a bottle, and then if I die, uh, the fairy will come back and give me some hearts. So they, they save off one health. Well, they save off one death. <laughs> All right. We're doing pretty good. I mean, this dungeon's pretty much beaten now. Just because we don't... We didn't need the book to get in. We just had to get around the stupid front door. Although getting the book will be nice because it'll get us to three pieces of loot. Ow. And if we don't have uh, the three pendants, it'll tell us what uh, words. It'll tell us what the uh, Master Sword is. Because there's engraving there. And it'll, it'll just say, hey, this looks like it could be missiles. 
I forgot which door pot it was. Bye. Gimme. Oh, it takes forever. Okay. Now, I'm going to keep the fire rod on me because the fire rod does a pretty neat job of doing damage to this guy. Way better than my stupid sword. Eh, if I can hit. I just suck with it, but... Making me look bad in front of the YouTube! Stop it! Okay, I think I got one shot left, and I think he took a hit, so... Of course I miss. I'm not blue potioning for this guy. We'll just finish him off the old-fashioned way. There we go. Missiles. Garbage. But we got the green pendant, and that's a good thing. Now, it's going to kick me out of the front of the dungeon. Or right here. But I don't think I can get back to... Oh, I can. Okay, here's the risk. I run back through the dungeon, and I can go into the light world, but I can't do Misery Mire anyways. But... I can go out the door and go back to Samus, but I don't have the screw attacks. So that makes life difficult there. Anyhow. Or, I go and visit Sasha Rasha la ba la la ba la ba bing bang and I turn in the pendant, and I get a loot, and then I can take all three pendants over to the Master Sword and get loot. Like, guaranteed I get loot from those two things. Oh, I hope one of you is the... I seriously hope one of you is the flute. Alright. Um, closest one to Shashara, la 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 bang bang. Okay. Last time I gotta come up this way. What you give me? Red shield! Okay! Okay, red shield, good. Red shield, very good. Dan. We're going to go here. Smoochies. Got to go. It's a kiss and run. Okay, forest time. Of course. Uh, this one. Come on. Ah! Sorry, I'm trying to think while I'm doing this. Alrighty. Magical Woodland Critters, what do you have for me? With all the power in store, I will be getting... Don't 
20 bucks? I give up! Oh, not really, but dude, that sucks. There's nothing else Light World, except I need to get the mushroom to get to the old lady. But I've yet to see the mushroom. Um... I gotta be... Ag oh, let's, let's see what that is. Because if it's like money, I think I'm just gonna ignore it. Like I did a certain arrow. That gained my ire. Okay. That's up this way. So, out here are two dudes sawing a tree. When you defeat Aghanim, they are done sawing the tree, and you can dash into it to get something. And for me, it's going to be missiles. I'm gonna get missiles! That literally tells me that everything I need everything I need is in um, Dark World. Except for the mushroom. Which the mushroom may be in Dark World. Who knows? But I've been, I've been everywhere on the left. I've been everywhere on the right. Been in the south. No. One more spot. One more spot. Oh, two more spots. Forgot. Whew. Power bombs. Three more spots. Oh, gosh. I keep remembering things. Luckily, there's the two of them are here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go away. You got to run into that one. Otherwise, it doesn't open. See what I'm gonna get. Okay, one more thing. One more thing. I, I'm gonna push the episode just a little bit longer today. One more thing. We now have the lamp, so we can go to the dark parts of this stupid dungeon. And hopefully get loot. There's a guy in here who gives me a key. It's you. You need to die. Thank you. Please bear with me, folks. Because this is... I gotta have. There's gotta be some redeeming quality here, right? Maybe? Please? Yeah, I knew I needed a key. Alright, here we go. This is. Oh, come on! Let me give it a dramatic reveal or something. Alright, this is. The Master Sword! So remember how I said before in the plasma room that there was the master sword there and I couldn't get out? It's one of the, pro they call them the progressive swords or progression swords. So the next level sword is either in the plasma room or that's the final sword. Either way, we are out of here. Not too bad, not too shabby, just a little over time. All right, I'm going to get out of here. 
Hopefully, now that we can do some damage with our weapon, we'll, we'll be a little better off. Anyhow, hope you guys liked today's episode. If you did, you guys know what to do. Uh, if you guys got seen anything I'm missing, let me know, please. Uh, beyond that, I hope you guys have yourselves a fantastic day. I'll see you in the next one. Later. Later.